rolling into week 10 of the high school football season with a slate of region matchups with teams either playing for a postseason spot or possibly home field advantage. And there's one particular matchup up in East Knoxville that's generated quite a bit of excitement. WATE six on your side sports reporter Kellyanne Stitz is live on the sidelines at West High School with more. Kellyanne. Hey, Tim, that's right. West Rebels are hosting Knox Catholic in a game that Fighting Irish head coach Steve Matthews says almost feels like an in-state rivalry college football game as these two dominant programs are very familiar with each other. Now, how this matchup came about was after both teams had an opening in the schedule as West was supposed to play Fulton, who was suspending football operations for two weeks due to COVID-19 concerns, and Catholic, who had a hole after Brentwood Academy needed to make up a regional game. And while these teams are in different leagues, this game will be a good measuring stick for the two to see how they stack up against each other in tough competition. With West dominating in their league and Catholic, who competes against some very tough teams in Division Two. We go, we go against competition on a tough competition on a weekly basis. But I, I think I think West is an outstanding team. Watch them on film; they look just like the teams that we play every week. And uh, they got some outstanding players, extremely well coached. And I know they're going to do a great job, and, and they're pumped up. So we're extremely excited. Now, Catholic has struggled to finish the games this season, and head coach Steve Matthews says he takes the blame for that, needing to coach this young and growing team harder. And he said this week, him and his coaching staff did just that. They, they were hard on them, and they had, he said, what he felt was their best practice on Wednesday that should give them some confidence in coming at a good time against this West Rebels team tonight. Tim? Thanks, Kelly, and we'll check back in with her for more from this game coming up tonight.